Pakistan, you see, outside polar region, it is very interesting. Uh, again, the way you asked me, uh, Nepal has a lot of mountains, but if you take away Everest, <laughs> they are left with very little. I have a lot of respect. I call Nepal as my second home, by the way. I love uh, Nepal and its people and the mountains and all that. But Pakistan is the only country outside polar regions that has so many glaciers and such huge glaciers. Siachen, <clears throat> 72 kilometer long. Siachen is part of Pakistan. And then Baltoro, and then you have Baturas and all those glaciers. Biafo Hisper, both Biafo and Hisper are two glaciers but they are connected. I don't know why they are named two as different glaciers. Actually, it's a continuation of one piece. I would rather call it one glacier, 110 kilometers long, the largest glacier outside the polar region. But anyway, Baltoro itself, where K2 and all the big mountains are located, Baltoro Glacier flows out of uh, the bottom of K2 and Gasha Brooms. Baltoro itself is 62 kilometers long from starting from uh, Concordia. All these glaciers, we don't have, you don't have any big glaciers in Nepal. When you go to Everest, you only walk on a glacier for about uh, one hour, less than one hour, 45 minutes. You are on a, on a glacier and then you reach uh, Everest Base Camp. But to go to any big mountain here, uh, especially K2, you literally have to walk on a sheer glacier for six days to Gasha Brum, you know, in K2, starting from Ascole. So the, the glacial wealth, I call them the water towers. Uh, some of the largest water towers of the world are, you know, located in Pakistan outside polar regions. And uh, again, we, uh, how many of the Pakistanis know this?